On this day in 1990, the UK's worst ever prison riot erupted at Strangeways in Manchester. More than a thousand prisoners demonstrating against overcrowding and poor conditions attacked prison officers and began a violent protest, which lasted 25 days and left two people dead and hundreds injured. Following the protest at Strangeways and other prisons, Lord Wolfe's report, after a public inquiry, made a series of recommendations to improve decency and justice in jails where conditions had become intolerable. This evening, Strangeways was ablaze. Prisoners who'd taken over the jail were now doing their best to destroy it completely. What had started during morning prayers in the prison chapel as a disturbance involving 50 prisoners rapidly became a riot involving nearly a thousand. They overcame prison officers, stole keys and opened as many cells as they could. Some smashed their way onto the roof and hurled missiles at the police gathering below. A prison store was raided, and while some prisoners dressed up in officers' uniforms, others took off their clothes to taunt the police. It's quite obvious that it's a, a major incident that has, has required us to bring many police officers uh, to the scene, and uh, it's my job to uh, try and contain that with other people. As prison staff evacuated Strangeways, hundreds of police, many in full riot gear, surrounded the prison. The tactic was containment, and prisoners in areas of the jail not affected by the rioting were bused to other prisons. During the afternoon, grisly tales began to emerge of what was happening to sexual offenders in Strangeways, now at the mercy of other inmates. A steady stream of prisoners came out on stretchers. They'd been severely beaten, but then rumours of prisoners being killed and mutilated. The police wouldn't confirm there had been murders, a fireman, though, said he'd seen about a dozen bodies. What had started as a riot over bad conditions was now a bloody and brutal conflict of prisoner versus prisoner. Today's violence has shocked everyone here, but former prisoners said Strangeways had been on the verge of erupting for some time. Everyone knew it, even the officers knew it. They said it's just a matter of time before this place goes. It's a powder keg, he described it as. Tonight, the full extent of mayhem and murder isn't known. The prisoners still control some parts of the jail. The police are preparing for a long and bloody occupation.